What is a nerve transfer? Well, nerves are made up of fascicles, and there is much interfascicular branching between these fascicles, apart from when you get close to motor branch points when there's sector organisation. So if you harvest a fascicle between the motor branches, you won't totally denervate the distal muscle. So this can be used perhaps in a brachial plexus injury where there's no function in the upper plexus, but the lower plexus nerves are intact. So this diagrammatic representation shows a fascicle taken from an intact nerve and sutured close to a denervated muscle. So the principle is taking an undamaged nerve to transfer donor axons close to a target, either sensory or motor. It allows very rapid re which can give early functional restoration or can salvage cases where proximal surgery has failed. And because the residual nerve side sprouts and increases the motor unit size, effectively there's something for nothing. You avoid the problems of co-contraction where you re-innovate multiple muscles from one nerve root in brachial plexus injuries. You can maintain digital independence over what you would get with a traditional tendon transfer and it's easier to relearn. So it's an expendable donor nerve that's effectively undamaged, harvested distally and the recipient is harvested proximally. They're sutured together, tension-free, ideally phasic muscles and you avoid nerve grafts.